hello, hello. There we are. Just getting ourselves set up here to do a live stream of Monster Hunter for the Nintendo Switch today. So bear with me. I just gotta set up a couple things on the YouTube end of things and uh, we'll get right to it. Feel free to let me know if the uh, the volume is a bit too loud or too much. So far it sounds fine, so that's good. Alright, I just gotta get like the game I'm playing, tags and stuff like that done, so Monster Hunter Rise, yup. Restrictions none. Playlist, this and that done. Tags done. Let that all save. Fantastic. Alright, let me pop out chat. We'll go do some hunting tonight. Get some practice in. I want to try out a couple different weapons. Uh, my tried and true for most Monster Hunter games is uh, the dual blades, and I also play a lot. To oh, hey, Luke's place, how you doing? I tend to play dual blades a lot and like bow gun, but I want to try out some different weapons tonight just to see, you know, how they feel, what's going on with them, all that kind of jazz. And I'm also open to the idea of doing some hunts with the viewers. If you guys have the demo on the Switch, we'll get that set up a little bit later on, though. Alright, uh, let's do... This screen set up? One sec, I just gotta make sure I'm all set up on my end to play the game. Playing this with latency is not exactly a fun thing to do. It is technically a fighting game, even though you're not fighting humans, you're fighting monsters. This is the demo, version 2. Uh, they added uh, Magnum Mallow. I tried a little bit of him uh, last Friday when he came out with a homie. He is hard. Like, just like, punishingly hard. Just kick your teeth in hard. It's kind of brutal. Uh, Mitsune is probably the highest hunt I'm going to take on tonight. Because again, I'm trying out different weapons. And to start off with, we're actually going to do the Great Kuchi, and I want to try out the Long Blade. I saw some pretty cool videos of it in action online, and I'm like, okay, okay, Long Blade looking good in this game. Long Blade looking good. Um, another weapon I want to try out is, is it the Charge Axe? No, Charge, the Switch Axe. The Switch Axe is the other one I want to check, take a look at, and the Gun Lance as well. So we got a couple different weapons to try out tonight. And after I give him a spin, uh, yeah, we can do some hunts if you guys are interested in that. The main thing I want to do between now and when this game comes out is get practice in because I'm super rusty with Monster Hunter games. This will be easy. Alright, I'm just making sure that this is coming through okay over on YouTube's end. Yep, we're good. Alright, let's uh let's grab some gear. Take that with us. Oh. Get away from the box. Hop on dog. And we're off. Sweet. Nice. Um, our target should be up by number eight on the map. I don't have my uh, my character avatar on for this because I want to make sure that you guys can see everything on the screen tonight. Uh, should be up here. Should be just up here. Wow! Found it. Excellent. All right. Here's the Itsukuchi. I don't know how to do the, uh... I 
There's a couple of cool sword swings that you can do, and I just don't know how to do them. Oh, I can take a couple of blows to the face. Though. It's more of a... Do I need to actually have charge on this thing? I wonder. Let's, uh, let's build up sword charge. Let's get in. Okay. I'm not used to... There we go. I need to figure out how to use this weapon. I don't know if the weapon or controls. Alright, let's hop on this guy. So we can do some damage, hopefully. Unless I'm just gonna get owned by the Tsukuchi here. Get him, get him, oh, get him, yeah! Alright, let's just launch, let's just launch. Hold it off. Bye. Can I ride this guy? I can ride him, alright, cool, let's hop on. This one I'm gonna just bump into the walls. Amazing! Oh, That'll do for now. missed the chance to launch. Let's go. After him. I gotta start learning some of the commands. Oop. 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 Got me good with that. I gotta heal. Oh, you got me twice. Oh, don't, don't take me out. Dog's going to town on it though. Oh hey, Jack, how you doing? Alright, I am using the Bone Sword for the first time in this game. That's the wrong button. Dog, come here. Dog, come here. Dog, dog, please. I won't be able to sharpen my weapon, but like on the go. Here he comes. That way I can avoid stuff like that. Just chilling. Let's get Digit chilling. I'm trying to get some practice in with the Monster Hunter Rise demo here.
That's the wrong button. Oops. Star Trek Next Generation? Uh, that's the... Which Star Trek is that? I'm not super Star Trek literate, unfortunately. That's the, uh, the one in the station, right? Hey, we got the Velociraptor bird here. I like the Lawn Sword. It has great reach. I just don't know all its combos. I know it could do some real cool stuff. But I just don't know its mechanics too well. Which is unfortunate. Uh, hunter info? No. Hunter notes. Weapon controls. Monster. Alright, overhead slash. Uh, thrust. Attack while moving. Spirit blade. Foresight slash. Eh. Special sheath. Oh, okay. That's the one I want. Special sheath is supposedly really good you can trigger a counter out of it thank you Capcom I've already pre-ordered the game don't worry Capcom when this comes out on March 26th we're gonna be playing a lot of this commander da data the best character yeah da data data he's he's good I like him all right we're gonna try a different weapon I'm kind of taste testing a few different weapons, and then we're probably going to start doing some like Mitsune huts with one. All right, this one is what was the next one I wanted to try out? Was it hammer? Both the axes are good. I've used them in the past, but they're not my favorite kind of weapon. I want to try gun lines. That's what it was. Oh, cannons here. Hello, hello. Oh, these are some large monsters. I mean, the guy I'm hunting right now is very tiny. Alright, let's quickly take from the top, look up the uh, controls here. Hunter notes, weapon controls. Right, we got lateral thrust, shelling. Charge shelling is hold down the button. The Verizon slash, guard thrust. Reload. Live and fire. Guard. Warm state cannon after two. Ba, 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 ba. Yeah, I'm not gonna remember any of that, but that's fine. Let's uh, grab our loot and go hunt. All right, Dogo, let's roll. Let's go. Yoink. Yeah, there's there's some pretty big creatures in this game. Uh, one of my favorite monsters in all of Monster Hunter is actually in this game, and it's in the demo of this game, too. So we're actually going to be seeing that next, I think. I'm going to put more time in with the Lawn Sword. I'm probably going to get my butt whipped for it, but we'll, we'll learn. We'll learn quickly. Hopefully. The, fa the best part of Monster Hunter is playing with people. Um, I really enjoy playing this game with like my friends, the multiplayer of it, because you can have up to three other buddies. All right, I think uh, that's our target. These are the hunting base. Yeah, this one's a much slower movement set.
but it has a shield, which is really, really nice. Oh, bear's here. Okay, what happens if I do... Cool. I'll have to see how, what that does. It's a very slow weapon. Like, you don't move around fast at all. Oh. Oh, bear. All right, I need to heal. Oh, that was a heavy hit. All right, I'm gonna heal up again. Oh, he's gone. He, he's just pieced out. Well, in that case, I'm chasing after. Where'd he go? Dog to me. Dog. Alright. Let's go see if we can find this guy. Oh, he's just over there. Poke you in the eye with this. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hi, new master. How are you doing? Black Diablos is really cool. Apparently, Diablos is in this game, so not looking forward to that. That's a hell of a hunt. Oh, good overhead. I got a sharpen. Dog. Yeah, one of the nice things about the dog is you can uh, use items and sharpen up on it. So it's really nice to just hop on the dog. Use your whetstone and then get back into the fight because it keeps you out of harm's way. Oh, I'm actually thinking about playing Monster Hunter World while waiting for Rise to come out because Rise is not till the 26th, right? Oh, my health is really low. You know, I should probably just eat something too. Oh, dog. You just saved me. Alright, let me get some food in me. Diablos is in this game, so it's gonna be great. I'm doing good. I hope you're doing good, new master. Okay, so Gunlance, very sluggish, but I like its moveset and it's very potent. If you have if you actually like reload the ammo properly, which I'm still a little bit incapable of. 
you can do some real damage with it, which is really nice. Especially if, like, the monster's sitting still for you. I think Gunlance is going to be my weapon of choice if I need to ch whip out a weapon that has a shield just to survive stuff. Um, Longsword's probably going to be the weapon I'm going to try and learn how to finesse, though I'm probably going to get my butt handed to me many times over. Oh, doggo. Nothing to it. And then my tried and true is just dual blades and light bow gun. I really like how light bow gun plays in this game. Uh, with the switch, they actually added like jars. Oh, I don't want to go to the eShop. Come on, Capcom, chill. I, I pre-ordered the game. I keep mashing A and ending up in this menu though. Stop. <laughs> so yeah, I'm thinking between now and the 26th, I might dust off Monster Hunter World. That should be pretty cool. Let's hunt a Mitsune. This is my favorite monster in all of Monster Hunter, by the way. Alright, uh, I'm gonna try the long sword some more. I wanna get some more practice in with it. I think it'd be cool if I could hit the ground running with Rise coming out. Knowing how to use the long sword at least a little bit okay. Um. But yeah, I, I kinda wanna just do a bunch of Monster Hunter related stuff between now and its release. So I'm thinking more of the demo to get practice in, more maybe Monster Hunter World, and definitely some more... Uh, I'm, I'm also considering doing some Dauntless. Dauntless is another fun game that's kind of like Monster Hunter, free to play, it's a good time. It's also on every platform which makes it really nice to coordinate with friends. You can cross-platform it with Switch, PC, consoles, etc. I'm probably gonna get my butt handed to me. Like, I know this fight, I've done this fight a couple times before, but usually with, like, my weapons I'm more used to. Longsword, I'm gonna be taking hits that... Uh, I'm just, just, I'm just gonna stupidly be taking hits. You've already finished the demo? Yeah, if you want to run it again, you can just, uh, you can clear your save file out and it refreshes your 30 tries. Also, if you haven't updated to the new update yet, that will also refresh your 30 tries. We are not after you, mister. I'm ready for this. You know what? Wrong thing. I wanted to sip line over this. Oh, there it is. I love the wire bug. Oh, he angy. Oh. Yep, he angy. Is it? That is not the button. Trying to figure out what what buttons the uh, special sheath. I might have to take a pause for controls again. It's such a pretty dragon. Nope, I got hurt for that. Look up 
notes on the hunter. <laughs> well, alright. Is that gonna hit me? It's gonna hit me. Uh, Spirit Blade. Special Sheep after attack. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Now I know, now I know it's after an attack. Can hit a couple different buttons to do a tech out of that. The enemy decided music are very good. Taco Bell or Chick fil A? Uh, I prefer Taco Bell. Uh, Alright, going back to weapon controls here. You can special sheath, foresight slash, blah blah blah, don't care about those. The special sheath, that's the thing that, like, rocks. Foresight Slash. Foresight Slash can be for performed mid combo. Fred's law and vulnerability window. Land after dodging an enemy tech to fulfill. Special okay, cool. Special Sheath. Uh, press the thing to Sheath. When Sheathing, press X to perform an EA Slash. While pressing ZR will perform a Spirit Slash. After a period of time, Special Sheath will revert back to normal Sheath. Quick Sheath is effect, blah 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 blah. Effect I hate text. Okay. If you hit the sl slash, okay. A mad attack that decreases the spirit gauge to one level. Time this against the monster's attack to repeatedly connect with the tech to keep your gauge up. Minor attacks won't interrupt you. Interesting. We'll have to try that. Oh my god, I'm being raided. Hello! Blue hearts all over the place. Welcome! Uh, we are monster hunting, and by monster hunting, I mean I'm probably gonna get my butt handed to me. But hi, welcome to the show. How is everybody? I I have noticed all of a sudden this Relia's in there too. Pay attention to your stamina. We got Finemon up in here. All right, I got I got get the dog out. We're chasing we're chasing after some hunt monsters. We're uh practicing some monster hunter rise. I'm trying to figure out new weapons I haven't played with before. Yep. And we're fighting the spicy, pretty dragon here. Oh, oh, hey, I'm getting my butt owned by it. Chill. Let me heal. Alright, we're good. I'm very excited about this game. I really want to... Oh. Alright, you Splatoon fans will actually love the ranged weapons in this game. I just gotta say, they added gyroscopic aiming controls as an option. So if you like Splatoon, you guys would really dig this game if you're good at aiming in that. Oh. I'm getting owned. I'm getting so owned. They add, they added they added gyroscopic aiming controls. So if you want to play like one of the bows or something like that, yeah, you'll be rocking it. Bars in the top left. Uh, very top one is health. A uh, yellow one is stamina. That dictates your rolls and stuff like that. Uh, the green blade one is the sharpness of your sword, and the katana-looking one that is. The status of my katana's uh, charge state. If I land enough of my spirit combos to fill the meter and get the full combo off, I will actually go up a, a state essentially. There's levels on the longsword that will let you uh, essentially get more damage out of the weapon. But you have to build up spirit. Where'd you go? No, no, no. 
Oh, are you leaving? No, you're not leaving. You quite the opposite. This demo is available for free on the Nintendo Switch, and you can do online play with friends with it. So if you want to give it a test spin, all 12 different 12? 12 different weapons are available for you to try out. Highly recommend giving this spin. The game comes out March 26th. Very, very excited for it. Oh, ow, 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 don't hurt me again. Chill, chill. I got a heal, man. Chill. Oh, he's doing slide. Oh, he got me. He got me. That was going from bad to worse real quick. Oh. <laughs> oh. Alright, alright. Let me see if I can change out some gear. Survey says... No. No, I can't. It's a demo. Alright, never mind then. Um... Just want to go over real quickly. You get a cat or a dog in this game. Or two cats or two dogs. Um, if you... What is the thing? It's, uh... It's this? You can pet the dog. And the cat and stuff. It's, it's... Oh, it's so good. Alright, enough the cat. Enough the cat. I want to pet the dog. Let me pet the... Look at the dog. The dog wants the pet. Oh, give the dog a pet. You can customize the pets, you know, color coordinate them the way you want. The default is blue. Oh, look at this happy doggo. Uh, the treat one, if I recall correctly, is really good. All right, here we go. Here we go. Ten out of ten. Game of the year. Alright, shake. Aww. Love you, doggy. Oh, alright. We gotta we gotta go, homies. Good. Yeah. Alright. The dog is a very helpful companion, because it allows you to kind of speed along the terrain, get back to the hunt real quickly, which is really nice. Um, some other cool mechanics that they added to the game is they added uh, something called Wirebug. Which allows you to, uh, pull yourself around and, like, run up walls and stuff like that. I'm using up my bugs improperly, though. Oh, you know, I can't... I'm, I'm fumbling it. I'm fumbling it. I, I need to practice this stuff, too. Let's try this. So it's pull, jump, hold the... Really? Can't run up that one? Maybe it's too steep of an angle. You can basically explore this whole map, though. Alright, let's see here. Let's try here. Please? Hey, there we go. Hey, there we are. Yeah, it's it's sick. It's so cool. Uh, basically, what that does is it allows the like really heavy weapons, like the great sword. You can high five the cat. You can high five the dog. Oh, it's great. But it allows you to have things like the big heavy like Buster Sword sword or hammer. Or, like, switch axe and stuff. Gives them mobility, because usually they're pretty slow weapons, and suddenly you can just kind of pull yourself around. Oh, there's the target. Huh, yeet. Oh, I tried to do a full slash off that cliff. That would have been rad. Unfortunately, they've noticed I'm here. Oh. Hello. Yo. I'm just waiting for some space here. Yeah, because it's 
this kid. There it is. I should have EA slash. Duck. Get out of there. Don't die. Pop a heal. Uh, okay, let's have the Mega Potion token ready. No, he's winding up. Oh! Oh, he got me. That beam attack is really potent. That dragon's super pretty. It's my favorite dragon in all of Monster Hunter. And it's available in the demo, which has made me just so happy. Uh, considering I have like one last life left before I wipe out this quest, let's uh, let's go see the dragon. There's a dragon available in the demo too that we can take on. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna promise I can beat it, but at least not with the longsword. Uh, Duggo. 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 Yeah. Duggo has, like, Mario Kart, like, drift and speed boost, which is really cool. So you can get around the map real quickly on it. Alright, this last... There's three monsters on the map right now. There's, like, a giant, like, uh, Velociraptor. That, uh, Bubble Dragon. And then there's, a uh, another Wyvern. Kind of just up in the corner here. We can go take a peek at that. This game, I have to mention, has been one of my most anticipated games of 2021. I am so excited for this to come out. Alright, rise up, Duggo. Duggo's so good, it climbs up things for you too. It's 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 the best. Where'd it go? Uh it looks like the target's moved over to twelve. The game has different zones that the monsters patrol through. Oh, here we are. Wyvern! So this is a Rathian. The Rathian is the green one, which is female. And the Rathilos is a red version that's male. You gotta watch out for her tail, it's very poisonous. And she does that little, like, flip thing that's really, really big pain, but... Oh, watch out for that tail swing. It's potent. This is a very classic Monster Hunter monster. She loves doing that tail flip, because that's going to hit you with poison. Oop. And again? Oh, I missed the second dodge. Oh, there it is. I got hit by it. Sip some poison. Take an antidote. Walk it off. Walk it off. Oh yeah, she has fireballs too, you know. My guy did not take that antidote. One sec. Sip up. She's very angry. Oh, there's the tail whip. Uh -oh. oh, and there's a fireball straight to the face. Tuck and roll to take the fire effect off. Sip another potion. Back up we go. Oh, and that's the tail whip again.
Yeah, okay. Oh, come on. I just took poison off. Rathian, Rathian, please. Chill. Oh. She's, she's maybe a little spicy with me. Oh, some friends have decided to join us. Fantastic. Oh, well, she took off. Alright. Can we... That doesn't do it. I just wonder if we could actually... Yeah, there it is. Return for quest. We're gonna change up weapon. We're gonna change up weapon. Let's go home. I want to show you guys, especially you Splatoon fans, the um, the ranged weapons in action because they feel really good. Uh, I don't need a pre-order. Already done that. Thank you very much, Capcom. Game comes out on the 26th. Look forward to that. All right. We're going to go back to the Mitsune. And I am a light bowgun fan myself. Here we are. I gotta make sure I turn the controls on too, so give me one quick sec. Go take a peek into the options, gyroscope, turn that on. See, now we got that rocking. Great. Uh, I like to turn the sensitivity down to about 25, personally. Around 20, 25. Yeah, let's do 25. That's where I had it um, earlier. Perfect. And then I also like to set uh, right stick and still control up and down. So what I like to do is the right stick controls the big movements. And then the just the subtle motions of me holding the controller control the, like, the nuanced small motions. So if I whip out the weapon again, the right stick will let me swing heavy, right? But then the gyroscope lets me just get, like, nuance on that aim, you know? So I could flick it up, and, like, lock onto target a bit. Flick it over here, you know, lock onto target there. It's great. I love it. I love it so much. It feels really, really good once you get used to it. Alright. Let's, let's go pop some shots. Uh, do we want to fight the Rathian or the Vitsune? I'll let chat decide. We're... Navigating there right now. You're gonna go. Thank you for swinging by, Flaming Grassy. I appreciate you guys all stopping by. Lovely little peek to the night. All right. I think we're heading for Bubble Dragon. I think that's where we're heading to right now. Shoot. Grab a spare wire bug. All these little creatures add little buffs, such as little bits of health, or armor, or stamina. Kind of nice little perks to pick up on the way. The the red, green, and yellow buffs, though, those are really nice, because those are permanent for the entire hunt, which is really cool. Oh, that was not Mitsune. Alright, Mitsune is up river more. That was the uh, Velociraptor. We need to go through this bend here. Ha having a dog is really nice, because again, it just speeds. Oh, and Mitsune has just decided to peace out. You can see by the dotted line on the mini map. That critter is taking off. Alright. If that's the case, we are going to also take off. Should be just down river. Doggo. Doggo to me. Alright, let's go. 
pick up some more perks along the way. Hey, there it is. Hey, gorgeous. How you doing? You hang around here often? Can I pour you a shot? And by shot, can I mean shoot you with a bow? Oh, my face. She did not like the pickup lines. Or me coming on to her. Fair enough, fair enough. I tend to have that effect of women. Let's get out of that attack, thank you very much. So you want to try and keep your rectangle orange, because that's like your peak damage with the ammo tape we're using. Whoop. She's beaming. Actually, I should probably whip out the uh, pure sound though. Pure sound is really, really good because she's really, really long. So if she faces me and smells with the camera, I can get some shots that go down her whole body. Like that. You do a lot of damage with that. Yeah, that's what we want. Ooh. Come on. Oh, oh she's beaming. I'm gonna stay just on top of her. <laughs> she can't beam me if I'm not in front of her face. Now another tip with Mitsune is she releases different colored bubbles. The pink ones are just typically her damage ones. But if she releases uh, green or red ones, you kind of want to hit those because the red ones are a damage buff and the green ones are health. So I'm going to take that health one for example. Also she changes color depending on her mood. When she's spicy she gets this uh, pearlescent red effect on her which is really pretty. And when she's tired, she'll turn blue. And when she's in between, she's just her usual pink. Oh, those are some beautiful shots. All those orange numbers are a sight to behold. That's a new attack of hers, that so she'll slide around on her bubbles Pay and just swing a beam stamina. around. I'm fine. There we go, just a nice orange. Oh, we knocked her down. Excellent. I'm gonna get in there. And uh, punch some charges and just open up. Oh, she didn't like that. She really didn't like that. Switch over to spread? No, uh, sticky. Sticky ammo is like these planted explosives. They'll go off in a second here. There we go. Like that. Reload. Calm down, calm down. Please calm down, ma'am. Alright, mind all those. Pop, pop, pop. Knocked her down. Excellent. Get that lined up shot for piercing ammo and just rip through her. I'm gonna take the break to take a little heal, heal, real quick. A little heal, a little heal. I'll just top myself up. Oh, she's also piecing out. Away. Delivery complete. Uh. Oh, she's going all the way back up. Okay. Dog, to me. Let's roll. Yeah. Ranged weapons have always been my favorite weapons in Monster Hunter, but the melee weapons are still very good, too. They do the most damage in some circumstances as well. Uh, there's 12 different weapon types, each with their own movement pool and playstyle, and then you can also finesse that even farther with like armor skills and just like other perks and stuff like that. So you can really kit out this game to suit your specific playstyle by choosing a weapon that suits your playstyle and a build that suits it too. 
It's uh, it's kind of great. Not gonna lie. Oh. Okay, maybe a little bit upset. I, 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 I don't know why. Okay, there we go. Stop from doing that. I need to switch up ammo again. Stop doing bubbles over there. Stop doing bubbles over here. Oh, that sucked. I was in the wrong ammo. Switch the thunder. Take a potion. Oh, oh, she, yeah, she angry. Oh, 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 that's double fight swing. That sucked. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Oh. Alright, that bug specifically that I popped there, that's a healing item, so I was waiting for that. Oh. Oh, 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 <laughs> oh, that was too close. You need to calm down, ma'am. Okay, then she's gonna swing across. I missed the dodge epically there. I probably should have just. Wrong. Oh, I hit the wrong button. I hit the wrong button. I pulled out. I hit the item trigger. What I want to do was something really cool, but I hit this button instead of this button. Because what I wanted to do was not this ammo. Why? Is that some... Come on, come on, come on. I wanted to do the wire bug pull. Which one is it? It's. I'm not a wire bug already. Great, cool. Never mind. All right. I'm an excellent. Excellent at showcasing the cool thing. This is what I wanted to do. I wanted to pop up and then, like, pop her. Yeah, that's a really cool ability. That's okay. With Dog here, we'll get back up there real quick. Oh, she's already moving to 10? Okay. Okay. Well, if that's the case, I'm gonna head uphill, actually. Oh, it's so cool. That's so cool. I love that so much that they added like vertical mobility to this game because that wasn't in previous Monster Hunters. Now you can just Breath of the Wild wherever the hell you feel and just 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 go for it. And it feels incredible. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, let's grab the defense up. Where is our dragon? Oh, there's our dragon. Hello, dragon. I'm out of range. Oh, she didn't like the cool acrobatics there. That's fair, that's fine. Take a sip. Cat up. Thank you, cat. Oh, got me with the sub bubble. What's cool is uh this game doesn't show you like health meters or anything like that. You actually have to just pay attention to, like, the monster itself. 
So you'll notice, like, part of her talons and her horns are starting to chip and break and stuff like that. So you can tell she's starting to lose health. She's starting to wear down. And when they get angry, they'll get angry for less longer, or, like, for less time. They'll actually tire out and stuff, too. Oh, I want that bubble. Uh, oh. Tail whip. Gotta watch out for that. Gotta be very careful about that. Come on. Just go down. Just need you to calm down just, just a little bit, even. Alright. Do I try the dunk? I'm gonna try the dunk. It's a sacred technique. Oh, I dunked myself a little bit, but I- Oh, I got her! Oh, I got her with it! Let's go! You can slam a barrel down and just dunk on the monsters now, which is just sick. It's so cool. Alright, let's riddle. Are you gonna- Oh, you're not gonna laser. Interesting, I was fully expecting laser time. Oh, there's the laser. I hear the laser. Oh, there's the laser. Up my booty. I did not react to that fast enough. I need to make a potion. Yeah, full health. Just really soak that in. Alright, good enough. Back to business. Back to business. Give her the business. I gotta stay in the sweet spot to actually do damage. Oh. If you're too far away, your shots are just weak or nothing. So technically, yes, you are a ranged weapon, but you still have to be close enough to deal damage. Oh, out of my face. Oh, you thought- Oh, you got me with the- <laughs> She spun twice. <laughs> I pulled myself up. And over the first sweep. Got hit by the second. Come on, Mitsune. I was trying to be real cool here. I was trying to be real cool. Uh-oh. Oh, we're about to see something cool. Are they actually going to fight? Or are they chilling? So the monsters, when they're in the same territory, they can actually, like, get peeved with each other and start fighting. I gotta be really careful. Cause they... Oh, here it comes. Look at this. Oh, she actually stunned it. Excellent. Well then, in that case, don't mind if I do, I'm gonna just uh, take you for a ride, buddy. I need you for uh, for just a little bit. Yeah, we're, we're just, we're just uh, flipping and dipping here. Ride him, cowboy. Get him, girl. Yeah, oh yeah, that's a chunky bit of damage. Oh, she didn't like that. Get out of the way. Oh, she's beaming us. Get her. Oh, yeah. Mounted Punisher? Yeah, let's do the big ol' attack. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you can mount the monsters. It's so cool. Did it twice. That sucks. Uh huh. I hear I hear your complaints, and I would just like to follow these shots to your face instead. Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? There she is. Oh, she's spicy. She'll use her soap bubbles to like slide around and be more evasive. Out that hurt. That, oh god. And she didn't hit me twice, thankfully for that. I'm just gonna hide behind this pillar and heal. 
she's just like, I didn't take none of that. Oh, Thunder Beetle. I can Thunder Flight her. Oh, unless she wants to just get spicy. Will you chill? Will you come down? Will you just... Oh my god. That almost killed me. Uh... I... I... I heard the charge up. I heard the charge up. She wound up and she just... Bopped me. Yeah, you can see you can see her earphones are starting to break down and stuff. It's really cool. There's no health meter. You actually just have to wear the monster down itself. Any other supplies? Oh, actually, there is more normals. And we'll take those, and we'll take those. Thank you. Can I make piercing ammo? No. I don't have that set up. Oh, hi, Rathian. We're not partying with you. You can, you, you can just hang out. You're cool. We're cool. Be cool. Excellent. Now, I don't mean to worry anyone, but I think I've died twice now on this hunt. So if I die again, that's kind of it. That's kind of it. Oh, she's going to six. We can meet her there. You can see on the map that her movement is uh, heading towards six. Oh, uh, grab the cloth. Oh, that's a tack up. Nice. I'll take that. Hopefully that doesn't wear off by the time I get there, but... Let's... Catch her off guard. See? See? She's blue. She's tired. Isn't that cool? I love that she color changes. And now she's hit the resting spot she wants to be at. Alright, Butterflame. Thank you. Alright, spread fire. Oh, that was close. That was very close. Careful now. There's the beam. Oh. You thought... Oh, she angry now. So, while with melee weapons, you have to manage like their sharpness and resharpen them mid-fight, uh, ranged weapons, you have to deal with ammo. So, like, that's the counterbalance to uh, complexity with that. Oops. I just pulled myself out of there. I just didn't want to deal with it. Oh, and she decided to just sweep me anyways. Alright, I'm sitting down. Pop the Mega, please. Perfect. Cat got some more heals down. Phenomenal. Outstanding cat play. And it's not gonna hit hard if I stand, like, pretty much right underneath it. Oh, never mind. It's gonna hit real hard and hit me down to pretty much one hit and death. All right, we gotta heal. Don't look at me like that. Five minutes in Monster Hunter and chill, and just giving you that look, you know you're in trouble. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, she's really mad. I don't know why, but she's really mad. 
What else do we have? We have uh, more thunder ammo. Okay, cool. Pop some of that off. Hey, that actually got her down. That's brilliant. Uh, pop them off. Oh, she hit me with that. I gotta be careful, I'm starting to run up. Oh, no. Okay. Babe, you need to chill, because I need to heal. Alright, we're good now. I should block up my shots. Where do you think you're going, Missy? You get back here. Alright. Oh, she's getting food. Oh no, she's fighting. She's just like annoyed that he showed up. Yeah, I'll take it. Oh, this game is rad. I love this. I cannot wait for Monster Hunter Rise to come out. It's out on the 26th. It's gonna be great. Look forward to more Monster Hunter content. In fact, there might be more Monster Hunter leading up to it. I'm thinking about doing maybe some Dauntless, maybe some Monster Hunter World. I'm not sure. I definitely need to get better at the game before it comes out. I'm definitely going to do more of the demo, too, to get practice. Oh, oof. I want to learn the Lawn Sword, I think. It's hard solo. It's much more manageable with a home here, too. But, see, the other problem that we're dealing with is the demo has set armor sets with each weapon. So I'm not using a loadout to my taste and benefit. I'm just using what the game gives me right now. When the actual game... Oh, there we go. One bad dodge, and that's it. Ah, it was close, though. You were getting her down pretty low. Ah. Thank you for playing. Thank you, Capcom. Monster Hunter Rise is good. I'm bad at it, but that's fine. As I was saying, um, the base game tends to be a bit more manageable because if you have a, if you have problems fighting something, it usually means that you just have to level up your gear. Oh, why did I, I keep hitting the... Yes, I went, I've already pre-ordered the game. I wish that the demo could somehow detect that and stop asking that question so I can keep mashing the A button. Alright, I want to try... I'm not going to try this guy. This guy, he'll one-shot you in some armor sets in the demo. It's brutal. Eh, you know, it's script. Script. If I know that I'm going to die to him, it doesn't make it that bad of a problem. You legit missed it then? Nah. Nah. We're still hunting. You don't want to use... Something... You know, I gotta stick with my tried and true. I don't like being up close and personal with this guy. He hits like a truck. So I'm just gonna kind of stay away from him. And just dodge. Just dodge. Um, he has two, three attacks that can completely one-shot me. I had this because the demo item, or demo armor sucks. Oh yeah, by the way, 15 minutes, good luck. It's kind of brutal. This guy's a flagship, like, boss monster, so they're just, they just kind of put him in this just as a funny haha. -ha. They're like, yeah, if you guys want, you know, a challenge or whatnot, have fun. Here you go, video game. Uh, I think he might be over at six fighting something actually. Cause there's two question marks over at that um, quadrant area. I'm absolutely gonna be picking up every little perk bug and critter I can find on the way there. Sweet. Uh, more health please, yep, thank you. Oh yeah, yeah. The, oh, both of them. Just, just, just chilling. Hi, Mitsune. Fancy meeting you here again. 
You want me to help me no, with uh, him? This problem? I got a hit. Oh, he's just gonna go in on her. Oh, they're fighting now. You're my target. Not gonna get distracted. Oh my god, that almost killed me. And that almost did too. I gotta heal. Gotta heal, gotta heal, gotta heal. Gotta heal, gotta heal, gotta heal, gotta heal now. Oh, that tail spike is the one shotter right there, by the way. Full health or not, you're toast. Oh, he's so cool looking, though. So if I remember correctly, his weak spot is his armies. So we want to shoot that a lot. Oh, oh, oh. Hi, friend. Don't hit me with that. I gotta pick out uh, ha, 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 different ammo. Oh yeah, he has projectiles, just cause why not? Wrong ammo. That sucks. That's what we want. Oh I didn't dodge. I didn't dodge that guy. I look forward to fighting this guy at the base game when I actually have gear and stuff too. And not like 15 minutes to take him on. Thank you, Capcom. Very fun. Now, listen. There are people out there that know this game well enough already from the demo alone that are able to beat this guy in like 10 minutes solo. With one weapon? Do I believe that I can do that? No. No. Not a chance. But am I going to keep looking at this pretty monster? Absolutely. Am I going to shoot it while I do so? Absolutely. Oh. That was not the button for Firebug. Come here, you. All right, let's catch up to this guy. He's moved up to 10 already. He's moving. Oh yeah, that powder stuff. Yeah, it's explosive, just heads up. Because of course it is. A little bit of Teostra in there. Oh, then his music is super cool. Gotta watch out for that move, too. Suddenly it turns into a Tohu Project game. Oh, Mitsune, hi, how are you doing? Yeah, keep running. I don't, yeah, that's good, good, good choice. What's he doing? Coming in on my cat with the people's elbow there. That's what he's up to. Oh, that tailpipe is so brutal. Get out of the poison cloud. Alright. Oh, he hit me? Oh, he hit me? Oh, no. Sorry, sir. I gotta take a sip. You know what? I'm gonna take another sip. Thank you very much, sir. Have a nice day. Get me out of here. Oh, I tried to get out of there. That did not work. Even at full health, 
even at full health. Now you see why I keep healing to full health, because it, it just... If you don't, he's gonna one-shot you. If you do, he's gonna one-shot you. <laughs> oh, he's so hard. He's so cool, though. I wonder what his armor set looks like. Oh, I can't wait for this game to come out. So, for those of you who are new to Monster Hunter, who are not familiar with the premise, uh, you hunt monsters to get parts off of them to make weapons and armor that will make you stronger and more capable of fighting bigger monsters, which will give you better parts to make better armor and weapons to hunt even bigger stuff. Rinse and repeat and rinse and repeat and rinse and repeat. Random clowning, you're taking off? Well, you have a great night, sir. Alright. We're gonna go until I either A, beat this guy, not happening, or B, died to him another time, probably happening. And then I think we're gonna cut the stream there for the evening. It is getting late for me as well. I just wanted to hop on, try out weapons, get some practice in. It's all good, it's all good. Where is he? Oh, he's just chilling over there. Just having a lovely time, hanging out with the wildlife. Yep, just roasting up some ham. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm sorry, guys. I just looked at him the wrong way. <laughs> Thank you for playing. <laughs> By the way, the game's coming out March 26th, you know. <laughs> Ow. Make this armor is the longsword armor? Thanks for letting me know. I will take a closer look at it. It looks good, from what I recall. Oh. Yeah, I'm looking forward to this game. I have it pre-ordered already. It comes out not this Friday, but next Friday. Uh, expect more Monster Hunter related stuff from me from now until then. Uh, I'm probably gonna play some more Dauntless. That's probably one of my favorite Monster Hunter-like games. It's a free-to-play Monster Hunter. It's available on all platforms. Highly recommend checking that out. It's cross-platform multiplayer too, which is really sick. So if you're on PC or console, we can all play together. Maybe we could do that for a weekend coming up. Um, if you ever want to catch a hunt with me or a random Smash Bros match, uh, my Discord's the place for that. Link in the description. And, uh, yeah, outside of that, thanks for watching. Thank you all for the raid. Love that. Super kind of you all. And, uh, yeah, expect more Monster Hunter from me. I'm gonna do more, like, indie game showcases like I kinda did with, uh, Celeste today. And I have a project, a secret project that's in the works. I've done a collaboration with a fairly large YouTuber. The largest YouTuber I've collabed with so far. But that project's under wraps right now. And when it when it is ready to be shown, I will have a banner of a video or two from that to share with you all. But that has to be kept secret for now. I can't, I can't spoil it. But I'm very excited about it. Um, so yeah. I want to thank you all for watching. And if you want to stay in touch with me in terms of like Smash Bros. and monster hunting with me, uh, yeah, stick around the Discord because I'll usually do calls for that if you guys want to take in. You guys can also set up groups in my Discord as well, play with the community and all that. Thank you all for watching. I want you all to have a fantastic night. Draw Sage out. Hi there. That was a video. I hope you enjoyed watching that. If you want to see what I have planned for the future, consider subscribing. And if you want to see what I've done in the past, take a look at these videos over here. My name is Drell Sage, and remember, stay comfy.